friends welcome back or welcome to my channel so i wanted to do kind of a week in my life i have you know a lot going on this week i'll be in the office in and out running around and stuff so i wanted to do a little bit of a vlog what i'm wearing this week it's sunday i just finished filming my video for like understanding quality of clothes and why things cost more than others etc so make sure to check that out if you haven't seen it yet i hope you like it i think it's gonna be like a little bit of an educational moment for everyone and yeah so let's just do a little vlog here as well so this is what I wore for my filming video. I will be linking all these outfits and similar outfits and stuff and doing a spring haul. Like there's all this stuff coming down the coming down the way. I just need time to edit and film. Little life update, things that work are really crazy. We're down two people on our tiny team of like seven, down to five. So it's affecting my personal life because I'm working longer hours to keep up, you know, with that situation. And then there's just like some other stuff going on for career. So I'm trying to like apply to that job and like there's a lot of moving parts. So that's why things are a little delayed these days. But I hope you stick with me and you're fine and everything's fine. And I thank you so much for staying here and being my friend and going along with the chaos. So with that being said, here is my outfit of the day. This hat I got from Anthropology for my birthday. They do like 20% off. So I got it for like 30 bucks. It's still kind of expensive for a hat, you know, but I do really like it because it's pink and it's exclusive to them. It's LA, I wish it was New York, but it's fine. Whatever, top. I got this at a sample sale for work. This is Veronica Beard. It's literally so cute because, wait, okay. She's adorable like this. Look at the back. There's a ruffle. It's giving ruffle. It's so cute and fun. I'm obsessed with these like more abbreviated shirting things and shirts in general, like this kind of preppy movement that's happening um, is really like a trend I'm loving for spring. I also just love the little ruffles on the sleeve cuff, like so cute. I think with a jacket like poking through, it would be really cute. So I need to wear this. I might wear this this week for work. So don't judge me, whatever, who cares? I just wore this to film and like take pictures in the park. <laughs> Moving along, these jeans are from Outer Known. I got them at half of half the last time I was there in Kansas City and they're super super cute and I love them so those are adorable and then my shoes are from half of half as well they're joie I love them they're cheetah I think cheetah is so so cute especially with stripes there is a picture on Pinterest that is in my mind rent free cheetah jeans and like a stripe button down so I want to get some kind of cheetah pant, maybe like more of a satin trouser or something. It's kind of like on my mind. I don't know that I'm a cheetah denim girl, but like I could be down for a cheetah pant um, that's like satin. Anyway, so that's the outfit for today. And I just need to clean up and start editing. So I've probably changed, but I wanted to show off my cute outfit and start a vlog. So yay, happy Sunday. Monday. I work in the fashion industry, so take this a little bit lightly on what I'm wearing to the office. I can wear hats, I can wear jeans, I can do literally honestly whatever I want. People wear crop tops, people wear sweatpants. You just like style it in a fashionable way and it's fine. So today's outfit is a little funky monkey. It's giving that sporty casual vibe that I've been really loving. So I just threw on this Legence Henley. Henley tops are really in. Um, I got this in Kansas City at a half of half, which is like a designer discount store in Kansas City so check it out if you haven't I every time I go I do a video I recently got this little rib knit crew neck it's like tighter and cuter it's from H&M I love H&M's knits I feel like they're really really affordable and they do stay nice longer I feel than Zara surprisingly um this jacket is thrifted as well I got this like back in the day I feel like really early in my thrifting I can't remember or it might have been a hand-me-down this hat is from Brandy Melvo I also got these jeans at half of half their outer known and then my shoes are little silver ballet flats from from Poshmark but the brand is Dolce Vita I think yeah and that's my look today I'm gonna throw on a coat and we're gonna head to the office so welcome to a day in my life an exciting change of plans to start the Monday I am now having to go to four different stores by 12 to pick out different colored t-shirts.
it's been nuts. What's new? Happy Tuesday, I'm working from home. Um, it's the afternoon now, I went to the doctors and I went to Trader Joe's. I'm like so exhausted, I have not been sleeping well this week. Anyhow, here's my outfit. So this coat, it's a Zara coat that I thrifted. Love it, it's just like so easy. I think it's literally plus size, but it's that oversized trend that I love and makes everything like kind of chic and comfortable, like New York-y, you know, I feel like. And then I just kind of went for like an, a cozy vibe. So aloe leggings, I don't really suggest these to be completely honest, they fall down like whenever I work out, ever since I got them. And they're kind of annoying, but they're very soft and cozy. And I wanted the graphic vibe. And then I have this sweater that I got at a sample sale, which will be coming out soon, and I'll give more info later, but how cute. And then New Balance shoes. I love these, they're super comfortable to walk in, and I walk to like literally everything. Trader Joe's appointments, you know, New York City life. So let's unbox my Trader Joe's stuff, and then I have to get back to work, and it's gonna be a long one, y'all. Like, I could go to bed right now, but like also I couldn't, you know? My goal is to do a apartment tour this weekend. So here's my stuff for that because I was like, oh, I need to make it pretty, you know. And then I just got some easy meals. I always buy these because they're so easy to grab. These are also easy. I just put a little Parmesan and salt and pepper and oil. And yeah, my palette is very, very boring. Um, it's giving, I'm a white girl, what do you want? I really do need to clean out my fridge, but unfortunately I just like don't have time right this second. So maybe I'll be able to do it for dinner, but it's looking a little crazy in there. Then of course I'm a fruit girly as well. So we got our bananas and our apple and I go to the store like every week. So I just really get what I can carry and what I eat right then. Like I'm not really a bulk shopper. I mean, my fridge is the size of my body. So that's what you get. And then I got English muffins. So I like to, I'm like kind of on an English muffin kick right now, which I like to eat with my banana and then Cheetos and then Cheers. They actually had strawberries up for $3.99. I was like amazing, which also means I need to eat these in the next 24 hours, but it's okay. I will because I love strawberries so much. And then I'm also on a Pikachu kick. So I got this and then last week I bought tomato soup and I never ate it because I literally ate all the bread in one day. So we're gonna actually eat the soup and the bread. Actually, that's what I'm gonna have for lunch. So I'll leave this out. And then for dessert, these come with two apple pies in them. Like they're kind of miniature. They're called apple blossoms. And then a little bit of vanilla. I mean, it really just makes the day go by quickly and amazingly. It really is just like that sweet treat you need right before bed. And then here we have my dinners. So I usually will buy two of these, but I've started to really like these. So I actually only got one Cacio de Pepe and one of these. So like kind of a big deal, I'm not gonna lie. And then of course I still have other things like I have potatoes I never ate and the big weekly like needs, you know, and then it all just kind of piles up. I, I My budget's around $50, um, but it went up to 60 this checkout. I was like 60, then I recalled. I bought flowers, so that does that. But anyway, okay, let's go about the day, everyone. <laughs> okay, like Loki, it's kind of ugly. <laughs> All right, happy Wednesday, halfway through the week. You know, it is 50 degrees today. I'm wearing this. I might throw on a jacket on the way, but I'm wearing fully long sleeves, and this is the wool. Okay, backstory. If you didn't see my reel, I went thrifting like randomly after work one day when I was doing um, returns. I was just like, let me hop into the Goodwill, like might as well. And I found this gorgeous Millie sweater. It's kind of like a varsity vibe with this V with the little like stripes going through it. And I think that's so cool. It is thick, like it's giving happy winter, but it's going to be 50 today. It's 40 something right now. I just like don't know what to do with this weather because I'll either be freezing or hot. We don't know. So anyway, I'm going to wear it and I put a long sleeve tee on underneath it because I'm allergic to wool just in case I like 
end up i don't want to be itchy at work and stuck in this shirt you know what i mean so whatever we're wearing this i got it for 16 dollars millie did i mention so a stunning deal right and then my jean skirt is from h&m i got this last year i will link somewhere they're all over the market right now and really budget friendly um and then very exciting news my samba's got in so i finally caved and bought these and the pink and green i was kind of between the pink and blue then like just blue on blue and i ordered a bunch from farfetch for like so expensive like 270 for the exact same colorway and then i was thinking you know this is a little ridiculous like they're they're available on StockX, which is just a, set a brand like i've never used it but people use it so i was like okay friends of mine trust this like website i'm just gonna do it it took so long to get here but they're the exact same and they're so cute and comfortable i got the size eight in women's and seven in men's was the farfetch pair and they do fit i guess they do fit a little bit differently but like there's a little more space in these i don't know like i don't know but i like them and i'm very excited to wear them today finally and that's what we're wearing today we're heading to the office that i mentioned that and it's gonna be a long day so i need to actually really like get going Oh my god, running around like a crazy person. This is what I'm wearing. I ordered my Uber, so it's literally downstairs. Prayers they don't cancel. I got this jacket at Nordstrom Rack. It's metallic. I love the metallic trend. If you're not new here, you know this. I just got these pants in. They're stunning, right? So this is my new week of new clothes. So great time to be filming this, of course. Um, these are from Mango. I linked them on my like to know it. I will literally like relink this outfit because this I think is still in stock. This top is from um aritzia circa 2016 but she's still slaying and so good like the quality there is used to be really good i don't shop there as often now the sambas i need to find my wallet and i'm just gonna throw this on right like what bag do you bring mm -hmm. cute all right bye of course, I didn't have time to give any context to my evening, but my friend West literally was booked on Summer House, and he's killing it. You may have heard of him. He's slaying boots, so proud of him and everything he's doing. So we went to support him at his, like, hosted bartender situation. He was literally bartending the bar, like, actually doing it. It was quite hilarious. But that's what we were up to this night. So support your friends. Watch Summer House on Bravo and check it out. Bye. <laughs> well, happy freaking Friday, right? This is what I've been wearing all morning. Um, I'm a little bit hungover, but not bad. I had a sketch review this morning. My personal review at my for my career. This is my outfit of the day. Um, my jeans are from Frame Denim. Love these. Ugg boots, Ugg slippers. And this sweater I literally have had for years. It's just such a nice cozy sweater for like the day to day, you know? It's BCBG. I've been wearing it my whole life, I feel. Kind of crazy. I threw on a hat because like, oh, I'm over Anna. And that's the vibe. And my shoes survived. They did. They did, in fact. I need to keep working. I'm going to move to my couch, though, because my back hurts. Um, and so it's kind of the weight watchers today, so it's not sponsored, like, at all. I... Hey. Hey. Are you, are you ready? Oh, you know, it's just been, like, it's I don't good. know how we're going to do it at all, but it's okay. If you don't mind, um, it's literally a flood warning, so I probably won't be doing anything today. I've literally been sitting here editing all morning. Hopefully my video will be good and you guys will like it though. It's giving class. Well, I, <laughs> I didn't do anything today. I was supposed to go to like a birthday party, but it was literally pouring down rain and it's kind of like a friend of a friend. So it wasn't really like make or break if I didn't go. I think like a hundred plus people were going. It was like a big party thing. And I was just like, I don't know if I can do that. So, yeah, 
and then the girls went out to get drinks tonight but i worked 52 hours last week and i in five days on top of youtube and like guys i'm really drained like i'm not gonna lie like i'm starting to be unwell but i'll be okay it's just like constant so i took today to be alone and i like like i think it's okay you know like i worked on my youtube channel so i just need to finish the intro to that export it and do the descriptions and upload and make the thumbnail and then we'll be done and i'll be able to post it tomorrow morning i'm gonna post it on sunday morning and then and then what and then what mallory tomorrow i also need to do my taxes and get groceries so I'm also going to meet my friend for a bagel, so I think I'm going to wear a cute outfit. Like, I might repeat an outfit to have her take a photo of me so I can post it on my Instagram feed. Or I might run out and do that myself in the morning. I don't know. I need to, like, prioritize my life. Like, I'm, I want to do so much, and there's just not enough time. So it's like, how do we, how do we do that? Tomorrow I'm also wanting to film a video, my spring outfits video. So I started putting up what I purchased in the last month um which was a lot and i said i was not going to shop so much and then my mom came to visit and we went shopping and then i went thrifting and it's just like what's a girl gonna do my way of relaxing is shopping <laughs> oh my gosh i was watching the nickelodeon um behind the curtain documentary if you haven't seen it i would suggest it's really good it's really depressing though so not really something to watch if you're like feeling low anyway so i watched that and it's obviously really sad because it's about like pedophilia and then i freaking saved this movie priscilla about elvis's wife i had no idea she met him at 14 years old so i got to what like 30 minutes and i was like okay what what are with these like famous people literally grooming 14 year olds like 14 and he's 24 and she's at a party and she's 14 it's really disgusting at 14 i don't think my first party i was like 16 and i still felt weird and i was around people my age or maybe two years older than me imagine walking into a room of people drinking and smoking at 14 i literally don't know what i would do with myself i was like going to dance competitions and jumping into fountains with my friends like that's what I was doing at 14. So anyway, what I'm getting at is we need to watch something. My camera keeps unfocusing and it's really bad. I do apologize. Maybe you need like a kid movie. Although that's a little... Oh, Snoopy. Okay, I feel like I'm going to actually want to watch this, so I'm going to save it. Getting entirely out of control. Okay, I'm like, what do we like? I kind of started at this one. This is my first one. And then I was like, I kind of like it without the background. I'm trying to figure out how to like make my things better. Maybe this one's the best, but I feel like my mouth is weird. But like, it is like happier. <laughs> Add to, this is like my favorite. Sorry, I already took a bite, but like how amazing. These apple pies from Trader Joe's are stunning. Hello friends, it's Sunday. I know that I started this video on Sunday, but because 
Friday and Saturday were kind of a wash around here, you know, just really working away, laboring into the wee hours of the night. Friday I worked till 10 o'clock, yep. And then Saturday I worked on my YouTube till six or seven and then I, you know, continued working on it after dinner, doing the thumbnails and everything. If there's just, a, I need to start writing down my hours of what, like what I do and because I don't know where the time goes. And I'm like, I thought I had all this time. Anyway, so the outfits have not been picked out, so I need to do that. I was gonna go get a bagel with my friend Lily because she's moving out of the city. Very upsetting, I know. But she ended up getting strep throat. So that's why I'm not doing that right now. That was the plan. So I'm actually going to redo the plan. Okay, we gotta redo the plan. So I never got a photo in this cute outfit, and I really want one. I wanna put it on Pinterest, I wanna put it on my profile. So I need to go get the tripod out, put on the outfit, go do that, and then I might just pick up a big ol' myself on the way in, and then we'll come back, I'll pick out these outfits, and then we will film my video, and then I'll head out to get groceries, and then we'll do more of a reset evening, and then I'll start editing so that I get the week started off on a good foot. I kinda cleaned Friday. I could do some more cleaning though. I need to like unload the dishwasher. So just like, you know, tidying things up, getting ready for the week, kind of a reset slash content day again so I can catch up and get on it, y'all. I know, I'm sorry, I've been, I haven't been slacking, but I have been um, not posting as much. I'm not slacking, like it's not like I'm laying around. I promise you, I would never do that. So, here we go. It's 12 o'clock, let's see how we can do. I also need to do my taxes today. Okay, we'll do that tonight. Okay, let's get it going, let's get it going. So this is my new thing that makes you like hands-free and you set it up. It like goes to a Wi-Fi. God, it's so cold. I underestimated myself. I am actually freezing. While I was taking photos though, this um, retired man, so nice, was like, hey, like I'm a retired photographer. Like I literally have my camera in my car. I see you taking photos. Like what are you doing? Okay, he didn't start with that. He, it was like very nice. He gave me his card and was like, I like do freelance photography now if you ever need anything or I could shoot you right now. I was like, you're so nice. His name is John. He's a former New York Daily News photographer. He said he used to do fashion weeks and he was like wondering if I needed help because I kept changing direction. <laughs> anyway, I stopped by the bodega and got a diet coke because the line at the bagel place was too long and my legs are like like see-through because I'm so cold. Like I'm, I'm touching this and my hands are not, like this doesn't feel cold to me. I feel like it's lunch now so like skipping over the bagel situation. What a wonderful day. <laughs> Okay, so now I'm toying with like, am I doing spring outfits or am I doing spring haul? I don't know. This could be cute. Gray sweater. This, this brings it into this. Brings it into this outfit. Okay. Okay. I just wrapped up my video for this week, filming it. I really should go to the store. I know if I don't go, I will be sad, but it's Sunday afternoon, and like, that is prime. Everyone at the store, it's so annoying. But it also is like, you did the same thing, girl. You could have gone this morning. I think we just have to push through, because if not, I don't know what I'll eat, and then I end up spending like $200 during the week on food, and it's like, no, not necessary. We've been extremely productive and we might as well continue the pre-productivity. Put some stuff away. Probably wear this. I should probably take the opportunity of my hair and makeup done to do more pictures for the week. It's just freezing. Tomorrow I think I'm gonna wear this and my cheetah mules for my outfit. I think that'll be cute. Okay, for the store, I'm gonna wear this. <laughs> I wanna be cozy. I'm keeping the jeans on. I've changed my pants way too many times today. I feel like people might think I'm from LA with my LA hat, but like, that's okay, right? 
TJ Maxx return policy. Yeah, so we're returning this jacket. I'm so sad. But it'll be fine. Oh, where is my wallet? I think I need socks. Let's go to the store, y'all. Head it out. Again, I'm pretty sure I did a, a store vlog already in this video, but I didn't get everything I wanted. So I needed to get more of these already because yum. I needed some chocolate, so I love getting this. A little treat, if you will. I have hummus still, but I don't have crackers, so I got these. Those will be good for lunch. I have English muffins, but not... Uh-oh. Oh my god, I thought someone was behind me. But not avocados, so now I have avocados. I need to do something with this. I want to make banana bread, I think. I'm really on an apple kick right now. Which is good, because it's all I can afford. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm joking so much. Um, I haven't had baked potatoes in a minute. So I'm going to have a baked potato night. Ran out of my unexpected cheese, so need that. This I got for work. I got the reduced fat last time and I was so hungry. Ate all my strawberries, so got more. $3.99. I'm going to wash, cut, and put these in a container now so that I actually eat them when I'm busy with the work week. Needed a refill on my almond milk. Check. Bread, so I can have grilled cheeses. I almost got the Aziogo bread again, but I just eat it all in one sitting. So, so I need to learn, you know, Maybe those breads like that and like the Hawaiian roll breads are my kryptonite. I could literally eat the whole bowl. Like I, I and I do. It's a thing. And then I have stomach ache and I'm like, oh, I don't feel so good. How to get more of this? How to get more of this? I have broccoli in here, not to forget. This is so freaking good. Actually, that's what I'm going to have for dinner. I honestly am starving like right now. So I think I'm going to eat dinner right now. I'm going to put these broccolis in with this. It has like peas and stuff. It's just really good. The first time I got it, when I was checking out, the woman was like, oh, I love putting anchovies in there. My heart, I said, ah, oh, that would be good. Imagine, imagine me eating anchovies. We don't talk about anchovies. Mini pizzas, hopefully I won't burn them all this time. And I needed a refill on my tortillas. Tortilla. So I really think I'm good from the store, probably for like a little, little while um of course i forgot the one receipt for this so i'm gonna have to do that uh, on the way to work or something this week <laughs> Like, it's gorgeous and delicious. I put a little cheese on top, added the brock. She's a sleigh. Anyhow, so I'll probably just wrap it up here. This week was fun. It was fine. It was working, working, working. It's really my life right now. Not as much fun, but... I mean, I'm having fun. But like, I know I'm not, like, socializing as much. But is that illegal? Like, is it bad that I'm, like... It's fine. Anyway, the rest of my night really looks like this. I'm gonna edit probably... I did my dishes, cooked my food, edit, made my collages, post. I was gonna do my taxes this weekend. I'm gonna do it next weekend. 
everyone's gonna be so busy and out of town for Easter that I'm like, it's fine. I'll just have another boring weekend, nothing to see here. And we're gonna call it a day. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys loved it. Um, I sure as heck like doing these vlogs. You know. And that's a wrap. I'll see you guys in my next one. New videos, whenever I get to it. <laughs> uh, all right, love you, bye.